Welcome to Keep Rolling and today we're testing out the Symmetrix V6 frames from Adapt. I've been wanting to give these a go for a few years now and Adapt were kind enough to send them out to me for review. So I'm here at this brand new skate park here at North Walsham. I'm going to take them for a spin, see how they feel. Let's go. So, so far, really enjoying these, you know, just rolling around, they feel really rigid, uh, really stable, you know, not on the same level as, as the solar frames, but I wouldn't expect that given these are plastic frame, not metal. Um, but when it comes on to grinding, I don't know what they've done. Like, I think it just must be to do with the, like the angle of the H block, the, the way that they've done it, the way that it aligns um, with the Royale groove on the adapt sole plates, absolutely outstanding. Zero problems with the wheel bite, despite it being quite a narrow H block and that, that H block, um, just feeling like it holds you into the grind really nicely. So, so first impressions, definitely really positive. So, uh, frame sliding really well, even on that fairly new um, unwaxed rail, which I think is a really good reflection of just how well these frames slide. I just want to talk briefly about the specs. Um, so they come in black or white. This is the size large in 270 millimeters. You've also got the uh, medium or small um, in 245. Both uh, the hardware um, and the frame itself are both CNC machined in-house by Adapt. Absolutely beautiful piece of design. I think they look great um, on, on the Adapt skates. The hardware itself has been updated so that you now only need one Allen key um, to tighten it up, which is definitely um, always a bonus. Um, and it's a beautiful bit of hardware. Like this is not your kind of like off the shelf, you know, machined in China hardware. This is, this is really top notch. Just feels really quality, looks really nice. Um, and the same goes, you know, for the frame itself. Really hard plastic. I think it's gonna last um, a really long time and be a really good investment for your adapt skates or any other skates for that matter. Um, what should we move on to now? Maybe onto the bowl um, and see how they feel uh, doing a bit of uh, pumping around the corners. So frame's feeling great, uh, pumping around the bowl there, holding their speed, you know, really nicely. Um, not on the same level as like the solar frames. I mean, they're not a metal frame, so they're not gonna have as good a power transfer. But even on these like kind of 60 millimeters, which are a little bit worn down, a bit flat spotted, I'm still finding I'm carrying my speed really nicely, which I think is a really good reflection of how the frame performs in terms of stiffness and rigidity. Again, grind is feeling really smooth, despite the coping being unwaxed. I forgot my wax today, but it's turned out to be a really good test. Um, and yeah, on the whole, just really impressed with them. They're just feeling great, um, pumping around the bowl. Um, let's just get back Savannah on the ledge, which is a really good, I think, indication of, you know, ultimate uh, flat setup wheel bike performance. Sliding really nice on that back sav, feeling the most confident I probably ever have with that trick. No problems with wheel bite, holding it in really well. Combination of the H block and the backside plate on the on the adapts and the symmetrics, feeling awesome. I'll leave a link in the description and if you want to check out these frames and pick them up for yourself. Currently priced at 140 euros. Based on my first session, I can think I can safely say this is going to be my new go-to setup for flat skating. Absolutely outstanding. Just getting the best of both worlds in terms of rigidity, grinding performance. It seems to have the whole package. They can ride up to 65 millimeters flat. Um, only got them on 60, so interested to try some different wheel sizes as well. Hit like if you got some value from this video. Subscribe to the channel for more content like this. And leave me a comment. And let me know what your favorite flat setup is and why. I'm Chris Chadwick and this is Keep Rolling. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.